everybody thanks so much for joining me again today for more to diaries uh, as always we're going to wait for a few seconds for the people to join and then we're going to start hello there good morning or good evening whatever time it may be where you are hi everybody how are you guys doing oh thank you so much hi there morning good evening uh, as always manasama is not going to be in this broadcast so please don't expect him to join later or anything like that because unfortunately it's not going to happen uh, but we have a few new items to talk about today, so I really hope um, that we're still going to have a good time together. Hi everybody, good morning, good evening. I hope everybody had a good weekend. Uh, let's see, it has been uh, one week uh, since last broadcast, so I hope everybody's been doing well. Oh, thank you so much guys, very kind of you. That red accent, thank you. Oh, thank you guys. Hi hey everybody, uh, good morning, yes, good morning, good evening. I love the red velvet touch, it works well with the silver, well thank you very much. Let's see, alright, hi everybody, uh, well let's start, so welcome to episode 55 of Morty Diaries. Uh, my name is Andrea, I'm Seth and Bird, Morty Morty in Wonderworld, and um, Mana Sama is not going to be in this broadcast, but uh, today we have a, new, a few new items that are going to be released later this week that I would like to uh, introduce to you guys. But um, before that, I would like to briefly talk about um, something less enjoyable. So probably most of you already uh, saw the announcement that our event in Finland that was supposed to um, be happening uh, next February had to be postponed again. Uh, because it just doesn't seem feasible uh, to hold an event like that uh, in a few months time. So um, unfortunately the event has been postponed to uh, next year in September, September 25th and 26th. Um, which is really sad but um, I really hope that it gives more people uh, the opportunity to uh, um, attend this event because yeah even if we had been able to do it in February um, a lot of uh, people especially from outside of Europe definitely would not have been able to attend <coughs> so uh, I really hope that this new date will um, hopefully give more people the chance to attend because it's a wonderful location as well and um, I'm really, really looking forward to this event, so uh, fingers crossed that it can happen uh, next uh, September. And I really hope uh, to see all of you guys there. Um, yes, and of course we didn't want to uh, have a super spreader event or anything like that. And everybody's safety uh, is always the most important, so yeah. Very sorry, um, very sad, but yeah, I really hope that we can finally hold this event in uh, September, which would be... Uh, almost exactly one year later than planned, but uh, yeah, fingers crossed, praying, hopes and prayers. Uh, all right, um, thanks for all your lovely comments, guys. Um, let's move on to the new items. Uh, so I think uh, probably the most exciting... Uh, <laughs> deep red looks beautiful new. Thank you so much. So I think the most exciting uh, new item for today is, drum roll, that finally the clear... Uh, Jewel Cross Pendant is going to be re-released, so this is the new version of the clear Jewel Cross Pendant. I know that a lot of people have been waiting for this clear one to come back, uh, so I really hope that um, everybody will finally have a chance to get it. Um, I have the old one myself and uh, it's really just worth it. It goes with literally anything, so I really hope uh, that you will finally also, um, that everybody will be able to grab it. And we also, uh, in addition to the clear one, the green one is actually also going to come back. So um, in case anybody uh, was waiting for the green one as well, you were in luck. So this is a really lovely emerald green. Um, I think this would um, work really lovely with all black outfits as just an, um, you know, a colorful eye catcher. Uh, or with obviously with green dresses, like for example, the green version of uh, Sleeping Garden. So yeah. Yeah, and that's of rejoicing for the clear one, as expected. Yay. But um, lots of green, love for the green one as well. So yeah, so this is the first uh, new or rather re-released item. Uh, the Jewel Cross Pendant in green and in clear. Uh, so yeah, very exciting. Really hope everybody can get it finally. <laughs> Yay. All right, so this is the first item. Uh, let's see, then maybe let's go with the uh, 
new velvet accessory series. So we have, uh, or rather, velveteen. Uh, so we have uh, three items made from velveteen. So um, this headband that you can see here, and then this uh, ribbon tie that I'm wearing here, and you probably you can't even see it. Annette is actually wearing. Uh, I don't know if you can see this. Annette is actually wearing a uh, velveteen uh, short tie, I suppose, and then she's also wearing the. Uh, ribbon in black as well. Uh, let's see. So all three items come in red, in this uh, deep wine red and in black. Uh, let's see. So the ribbon head headband is detachable as always, which is always, uh, which I'm very thankful for because I always get headaches when I use these. So I just usually pin my headbands on. Um, and then you can also use it um, on in other places. Uh, however you like it. So yeah, here we have the headband in black and in red. And uh, let's see. Next would be the uh, ribbon tie. So this is also in black and in red. Uh, it comes with the M qua uh, Whoa. Yeah, that's better. Comes with the little uh, original cross charm. And then uh, it is freely adjustable, so it should fit um, all of uh, any neck size. And uh, yeah, it comes with our uh, logo tape as well here. Yeah. So yeah, uh, freely adjustable. And then it just closes with a clasp here. And yeah, so that's uh, our new ribbon tie from uh, made from uh, velveteen. Then. You can see it better in the red, so this is the new uh, tie, with also comes with a little cross charm on, at the end. Uh, it also actually features uh, the original logo uh, lining as well, so for you can't really see this when you're wearing it, obviously, but you know it's there, so that's a nice uh, touch, I think. And it's also freely adjustable, uh, like the ribbon tie as well. So this also comes in uh, this deep red and in black as well. Can't see it on my net at all, but it is there. Let's see some comments. Let's see. Oh, thank you so much. Perfect time for velveteen accessories, definitely. <laughs> Perfect for some what you school style coordinates. Definitely. Uh, so yeah, those are our new velveteen uh, little accessories. And then we have one more item uh, that I would like to introduce to you guys. Um, a new ribbon comb. Let's see, maybe start with the red one. So um, a little ribbon comb with the with another cross charm here, and then some candelabra lace here as well. Uh, so it's a comb, so you just pin it into your hair. Uh, it comes in Bordeaux with black lace, and then it comes in all white with a gold uh, cross charm, and then it comes in blue, in all blue with a silver charm, and it, it also comes in. I hope you can see this. It also comes in black also with a silver charm, which I am currently wearing. So this is the uh, last item, new item for today. Uh, yeah, so this is uh, definitely also um, a really versatile item, so you can use this for your... Let's take this one. So you can use this for uh, twin tails uh, if you uh, get two, or you can uh, use it, you know, anywhere you want, actually. Or if you have uh, braided twin tails, you can also use it here as well. Is the cross charm detachable? Uh, no, it's not. It's uh, sewed on. So, yeah. Um, let's see. Also, just uh, make sure to notice that this uh, Bordeaux and this red don't actually match. So this one uh, matches the... Um, the, the skirt and the uh, lace-up socks, uh, so yeah, and this is a different red, so yeah, Let's see. Oh, thank you so much. Let's see. 
I really always prefer combs over head bows. That's good to know. Is the charm removable on the ties? No, the charm is uh, sewed on. So, I mean, if you like to, you can cut it off and sew it back on again, but it's uh, it's sewed on. So yeah, you, had, you would have to remove it yourself if you would like that. Let's see. The ribbon comb looks so cute in conjunction with the head bow and your twin tail. So cute. Thank you so much. The big bow in your hair, is it attached to a hair tie? Uh, no, I just pinned mine in, but it originally comes uh, on this hairband here, but it is freely removable. And you can also obviously, go here. Okay. you can also uh, arrange it as you like, so you can wear it um, in the center or you can wear it to the side as well. So yeah, so that is the uh, big advantage of having this removable type of hair bow. Let's see. Um, let's see, so all of these items are going to be released on November the 21st at 3 p.m. Japanese time. And uh, let's see for the prices. So the the jewel cross pendants are going to be 14,080 yen. The uh, ribbon comb is going to be 4,400 yen. No, sorry, that's 3,080. The ribbon head bow is going to be 4,400 yen. Um, the necktie, so this necktie is going to be 5,280 yen and the ribbon tie is going to be 5,500 yen. Uh, all of these prices are including of tax. And then we have uh, some Mana Sama comments regarding the new items as well, which I would like to read to you as well. Uh, so regarding the ribbon comb, Mana Sama says, the ribbon hair comb is a cute item that nonchalantly becomes an eye catcher in your hair. Use this hair comb in various ways depending on your hairstyle. For example, wear it to the side of a beret. Depending on your ideas, it will be a wonderful accent. Uh, let's see regarding the velveteen head bow. The velveteen series is great for winter, isn't it? It looks very chic and is a great accent for your head. It wonderfully adorns your hairstyle. Uh, regarding the velveteen necktie, uh, it features a cross on the end as an accent uh, and original logo satin lining for hidden stylishness. Um, regarding the velveteen ribbon tie, uh, I wore this ribbon tie the other day for a photo shoot and it's both cute and elegant, pretty good. I wore both black and red. There is no blue one. Red has a kind of Christmassy novelty feeling, hasn't it? But if we receive enough requests for blue, I'm sure we will release blue ones as well. Um, and finally, regarding the jewel cross pendant, uh, the long-awaited green one appears, since I like green as well, you know. Uh, since it's a beautiful green, if you wear it with black coordinates, the emerald sparkle should be a wonderful accent. Of course, depending on your coordinate, you can also wear it with more colorful clothes. The clear pendant goes with any kind of coordinate, so you'll want to make sure to have one on hand. Uh, so these are Mana Sama's thoughts on the new items. I would hope I hope you guys sell more green items. I would love to see the lace up OT case in black and green for sale. Yeah, that would definitely be um lovely with um green lace up. So I don't know, we'll see. Hi everybody who joined later. Uh so yeah, that's it for today. Oh thank you so much, it's very kind of you. Um Maybe a quick word regarding our coordinates today. So I'm wearing Neo Gothic Arch uh, because I thought it would go nicely with the uh, red and silver uh, new accessories and obviously with the silver uh, tool cross pendant. And then I have, uh, I'm wearing an older Mati blouse as well. I don't actually have a lot of uh, blouses that go with this kind of accessory. So uh, my choice was actually limited today, but yeah. I quite like it with the silver. And Annette is wearing um, um, a quite old JSK with, this is actually not a Mortier blouse, and then the Mortier, an older Mortier cardigan with the new uh, tie and then uh, the lace belt because uh, of the matching uh, cross charms as well, so I thought this would go really nicely. And that's Annette for today for you guys. Thank you guys. Um, could you
you show us lace on your cuffs? Sure. Yeah, so this is an uh, older blouse that has some rose lace here. You see this? Hope so. Yep. Uh, all right, so that's it for today um, for me. So uh, do you have any um, any other questions regarding the new items or anything like that? Uh, will the lace belt be back in stock? Uh, probably eventually, but I don't know. There's no like set date or anything. You both look so perfect. Thank you so much. Sorry, kind of you. All right, let's see if anybody else has any other questions regarding the new items. So we have the uh, ribbon tie, we have the head bow, and the short tie, uh, both in black and red. And then we have the ribbon comb in four colors. And then we have the long awaited re release of the clear and of the green uh, jewel cross pendant. Can you show us a close up of the cross? I can try. <laughs> How was that? Um, well, all of these items are going to be uh, announced today at 3 p.m. So uh, please have a look uh, for more information uh, when all of the details are released. Is that the M uh, cross? You mean this one? And the one on the tie? Yes, that is the M cross. Sorry, I know it's hard to see. Uh, in stories so yeah let's see on the new tie I hope you can see this um, no you can't see this but yes it is the M, M -qua cross let's see some more comments Will there be any new pieces coming out soon in the red wine velvet? Uh, no, not at the moment, unfortunately. Maybe we get close up of the details a little while more, please. Uh, sure. Let's see. So uh, for the ribbon comb, we have the candelabra lace here. And then some satin ribbon threaded through it. And then we have uh, the rose cross charm. And then we have the comb in the back. One sec. Okay. Um, let's see. And the blue one has um, everything in blue. So it's blue satin ribbon, blue lace, and blue small ribbon here as well. And then a silver charm. It's also just like this in the back. Uh, the back of all of the charms features the little logo as well, which is a really uh, lovely detail, in my opinion. And then we have the white one, uh, which has everything in white, so white lace, white uh, satin ribbon, and then the uh, charm in gold. And here's the back, just like the others. Uh, let's see. I can't really show you the black one because it's in my hair and I don't think I can get it out. Oh no, okay. So the black one has, well, everything in black. Uh, black lace. Black satin ribbon. Uh, antique silver charm. The back. Just like the others. Um, let's see. The, sat uh, the velveteen uh, ribbon tie. Really can't get this cross to show up properly. So yeah, the ribbon tie in black, and then, let's see, so there is a little bit of uh, velveteen, so that um, the logo here, ribbon tape here doesn't show when you wear it, and then yeah, it's freely adjustable here as well. Uh, yeah, so this is uh, the same as I'm wearing here as well, and then let's see, the little tie, um, also has the cross charm. It's a little bit better. Um, and uh, let's see, it's double layered. You can also, or can you? Mm, not really. It's 
so you can't quite pull this through nicely so I would recommend uh, just wearing it like this so yeah and it does come with the uh, original moon logo lining uh, for some added uh, hidden elegance as Manasama put it and also comes with uh, the adjustable necktie as well uh, and then what oh yeah and the uh, uh, head bear is fairly simple comes with a detachable headband and you can either wear it with the headband or without and then you can just uh, put the ribbon wherever you like it to be or of course use it as something not not head bowy so you can also use it as a, a ribbon here or you can use it on your back or maybe on your waist or whatever you like it uh, all right i think that should be it did i show these this already no. and then the lovely green sparkling uh new jewel cross pendant and then also the clear one as well and i think that should be it uh hope that was enough detail for everybody uh do you have any other questions or anything Because if not, then I hope everybody um, will have a wonderful week. Uh, I don't know whether there's going to be uh, more diaries, but I do hope to see you guys around somewhere. And um, until then, I really hope you uh, stay safe and stay healthy. <laughs> Alright, uh, I think we're good. So yeah, uh, please check out the details for all of these new items today at 3pm Japanese time. And then they will be released on the 21st, uh, so this Saturday um, at 3 p.m. <laughs> very thorough, thank you. <laughs> you, all, um, you were really welcome. And so yeah, uh, so if you're interested in any of these items, uh, don't forget to uh, place your orders at 3 p.m. next Saturday. Oh, you're very welcome, everybody. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, all right, so I hope to see you guys around. And uh, until then, stay safe and stay healthy. And uh, I will see you. Thank you so much, guys. Goodbye.